Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel and hi if you're new here, I'm Melissa and I make fashion, beauty, and lifestyle videos here on this channel and today we're going to be decorating my living room and my Christmas tree, getting my house all cozy in time for Thanksgiving. And by the way, happy Thanksgiving because this video is going out on Thanksgiving day, which is so exciting and very fitting. Also ignore my finger, I have sustained an injury. So if you see my band-aid, just ignore it. There's nothing I can do. <laughs> All right, so this is just gonna be kind of like a cozy video. We have no real plans. I'm gonna spin you around and show you all of the decor we have to work with and the space that we have to work with. My entire island is covered in Christmas decor. Here is the living room. I have the tree up and that is literally it. So this is what we need to make cozy. I got these ornaments from Hobby Lobby, so I might start with these first and get like a base layer going on my tree. My theme is kind of like mixed metals meets winter wonderland, so a lot of white and then mixed metals. So I have some silver and then some gold pieces. So I'm gonna pop these on and we'll see what this looks like. But down below, let me know what you guys did for Thanksgiving. This Thanksgiving, Nick and my mom and I are gonna go to Seasons 52 to have a dinner out. It's gonna be a little different because normally we cook, but I think it'll still be good. But I'm excited to do this transformation so when my mom comes here, she can see all the Christmas decor. But yeah, I'm gonna start with these. Hello friends, I just wanted to pop on here real fast and tell you all how thankful I am for you and how grateful I am that you have watched my videos and liked and commented and just been a part of my community here on YouTube. It's been awesome and I'm so happy I've been able to put out videos for you all and just be creative and have fun with it. So thank you guys for watching and appreciating all the hard work that I've put into this channel to make it grow and have fun content for you guys. So again, just thank you so much. I hope you guys are having the best Thanksgiving day ever. I hope all the food is delicious and nobody has a burnt turkey. <laughs> I know this year it's different for us, but I'm gonna have such a fun day with Nick tomorrow and my mom trying out Seasons 52 many you i'm so excited to try it out but again i just wanted to express my gratitude for you all it's been so awesome and i can't wait to go into next year doing the same thing for you guys even through school it has been chaotic but oh here's my angel that angel is so cute i like love it so much i don't even know where i got it but it is one of my favorite ornaments oh and these star ones adorable love them gotta have them i got them at target that's my moscow mule one from target that was at the dollar section last year that one was also not in the dollar section, but it was there in Target last year. those from Home Goods and the other metallic mercury glass ones, they're to die for. And I think those are from Hobby Lobby, those little pointy things. I need to get more. All right, the tree is looking great. I only have four of these little spriggy things, so I might go and get more of those. But I used all the ornaments that I think I want to use. I just wanted a really clean and simple tree. It's kind of hard to see on camera, but it's really pretty. This Christmas tree is serving. She looks so cute. I literally am obsessed with it. Look at that star. I actually was able to do that without Nick, so props to me, but soak it all in in all of her neutral glory. So adorable. Those little mirror ornaments, so cute. And my angel. I think I'm gonna hang stockings now and the other decor, so I will move you guys and show you what I have. But first up, a close up of this tree. These are my favorite ornaments right here and the mirrors. And then this skirt I got from Target. So these are the ornament hangers I have. And then I have these really pretty knit stockings. This I'm gonna move out of the way because I have other things that I wanna put right there. That's so cute. So I have the three little trees right there. This is probably a better view. So the trees are right there. Over here, I have like a little candle set up. My tree is leaning and I don't know what to do to fix it, but it is what it is. This is looking good. I'm liking where we're at here, 
I think I'm gonna hang up like a wreath. Hmm. I'm not exactly sure. I'm gonna have Nick do the tree topper because I don't think I can reach that. So I'm just gonna put up a few more decor pieces that I have. I really don't have a ton because last year was the first year we bought Christmas stuff. So I'm kind of using up what we had last year, except those trees right there are new and I'm so happy they light up. But yeah, on to the next activity. So I kind of have this corner of my living room right here where there's nothing going on. I might do a little setup with all of these things, like a little collage of Christmas decor. So let's see what that looks like. I'm not quite sure. I'm gonna need you guys to tell me if you like what I did here. I'm so unsure about it, but I don't know what else I'm gonna put here. So give me some ideas if you have them down below. I don't know I don't know what like order I want it in it just I think it'll look cute no matter what but I'm trying to make it look good okay new development I've switched to the command hooks and these are working so much better I put the first wreath up with this and now I'm gonna do the smaller green one under it and see what it looks like because I can always switch them around what does that look so if you're sitting down there's the tree and then there's my little Christmas setup. I don't know. It's a little bit to the left, but you know, what are you going to do? It's good enough. I'm going to organize those wines later too. So they're a little bit more organized, but it is looking good in here. All right. I figured we could wrap some of Nick's presents together. And then the rest of the presents I'm going to have to gather because they're like literally around my house. I just so happened to have Nick's presents together because I did the video guide for him. And literally all the stuff that I showed you guys in there was a gift for him. <laughs> I had Christmas paper from last year, which is awesome. It's gold and white striped. So I'm just gonna use that this year. Now, normally I love wrapping presents, but I actually really hurt my finger. I don't know what's wrong with it. I actually might have to go to an urgent care. <laughs> Probably after Thanksgiving if it doesn't get better. So if I'm wrapping anything weird or holding it, holding anything weird, it's because of my finger. So don't judge me. <sighs> I miss the days I would wrap presents with my sister. We would normally do it together. And either my sister or I was like the family's wrapper for the year. All right, we got it. It was a tight squeeze. This is the jacket that I got him. And oh, I keep this in my Christmas stuff. It's literally everything I need for wrapping a present. So in here, I keep Sharpies, tape, scissors, and tags that I don't ever take out during the year. So I don't have to go finding them. It's literally just for Christmas makes my life easier so it's actually funny because this year nick got both of his big presents early is just how it happened but what we do i don't know what you guys do but my family has always wrapped stocking stuffers i think it just makes it feel like you're getting so many extra little gifts even if it's just a piece of candy that's wrapped up it's still fun so i continue that i love doing that so i'm gonna wrap all of nick's stuff and then I'm gonna make a little list of what I have in here in case I think I need to get him a little bit more. I can do that. And I won't forget everything I've already wrapped. I hope you guys can see, there's like no easy way to do this. I'm like doing a split. Oh my gosh, I saw this hack. I need to show you. So you start the present right here, like side up, then you flop it down, and then you put it on its side again, and then you flop it down. And apparently that's the exact amount of wrapping paper you need. So I'm gonna try it out, which some of you probably already know, but I don't. Oof. Oh my gosh, that works so good. Look at that. It's like the exact amount I need with like an inch of space. Well, now I know. I normally just guess, like complete guess it. And I always try to put the back of the present where the seam is gonna be. That way when you flip it over, it's like the present is sitting face up. Okay, so it doesn't look the best here, but at least it looks pretty on the top. And that's all that matters. We have these cute little bows. We'll just tape it on. I remember this wrapping paper from last year, like nothing stuck to it. So I'm fully expecting everything to just come off. And so it begins. 
I somehow cut it too short after just spending two minutes telling you guys a hack and then I didn't do it. My life. Oh well. It will not compromise the gift. This one I'm taping excessively for some reason, so he'll have fun opening that one up. I'm trying to get you guys a good view. I just don't know how far back I have to go. I'm off the carpet. So what I think I'm gonna do is find more of those little spriggy things to put in the tree. And then I want just a little bit more Christmas decor, just a little bit. So I'm gonna find more. I shouldn't be whipping these around. I'm gonna find more and then we'll do like a second part two decorate with me. So we're just gonna use what I have for now. But after all, it is only the day before Thanksgiving. There's time yet. This is just not my finest hour wrapping. So while I'm wrapping these presents, I just wanted to hear from you guys if you would be interested in a Christmas giveaway. I wouldn't do it until basically the first week of January, that way the whole Christmas rush is over. But let me guys know what you think and also let me know what you'd want me to include in it. Like beauty, fashion, what. But also I want you to take a good hard look at that coffee right there because it's about to ruin my life. So just stay tuned. clean that up that was not fun I'm gonna load it from down here and then I'll hang it back up splash zone it's looking really cute in here i had to move the stocking to the sound bar because it was falling off so yeah that's not fun but i'll just move the other one there too and yeah we finished it all that's what that looks like over there too all right you guys that is it that is the end of this video i hope everyone has an amazing holiday season i hope you guys have a great day today celebrating with family eating all the good and yummy satisfying foods so yeah i'm gonna clean up the mess that i just made and then i'm going to get ready for my day tomorrow so thank you guys so much for watching please feel free to like and subscribe if you have made it this far and i will see you guys in the next video on sunday bye